Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since I uploaded my last video, but I hope you're gonna enjoy this video. This video is gonna be another Elf Elite haul as they are having a launch on the 20th of June. I don't know the exact time yet as I'm recording this video, but I will find out and I'll put it in the description box below so you can check it out. As always, I will have my support code that you can use, which is Maria. I don't know, this sounds mega cliche, but I really do appreciate it. So thank you so much if you choose to use my code at the checkout. And don't be afraid to text me, send me a picture, tag me on your story, whatever. Leave a comment down here if you use it and I will thank you personally. It doesn't cost you anything extra, it just really helps me out with the brand. And before I get started, I also just want to say that I hope you're all safe and okay, considering what is happening around the world. If I'm looking at my phone, then it's because I did write down some notes when I tried on the clothes, and I just want to make sure like I get everything in the video. But let's get started. And also I will try to keep this haul to like a short haul so you don't just sit there and waste your time. So the first thing I want to start with is the Premium V2 Juggers. These are launching in three colors. They're launching in a light brown, light gray and a dark gray. I don't know if you can see but I'm wearing the dark gray here. And I have the light gray here so that's like a comparison. These. I would say like they're almost white. So this is not a new item launching. This is already there, it's just launching in more colors. And what I love about these joggers is that they are so freaking high-waisted. I don't like anything low-waisted. Who even does that? And then the material is so thin that you can easily work out in them and they are so super stretchy. Now the joggers do run a little small in the sizes. For the last launch they had, if you check out my previous video, I got the joggers in a size small and they fit me fine. However, because they do run small in the sizes, I sized up this time for a medium and they are a little big in around the waist, but they do have these here so you can like tie a knot or tie a bow or whatever if you want that. And I definitely prefer medium there's a bit more extra material around the crotch area but i definitely prefer that rather than it's too tight and also i really just like my joggers loose or oversized because when i wear joggers i need it to be comfy and i would rather have it a little bit too big around in my waist because i don't like anything that's too tight there except when i'm wearing tights and i want to look snatched but with joggers it just needs to be comfy do you agree and then i just really like the neutral colors because pair all these three colors with a white pair of sneaks and a white top whatever crop top sports bra and it's a super cute outfit because the material is so stretchy it's also really really good if you are a tall girl like me i'm almost 170 centimeters tall and i don't have any problem with them being like short or anything but if you're in doubt definitely size up and yes you can easily train in these i have worked out in these so many times but they are not sweat proof but it's joggers so they don't need to be the next thing is our surface wrap bra it's the bra that i'm wearing now which is one of my favorite bras and i'll tell you why i'll just quick mention the color so first we have the color that i'm wearing which is the cherry icy then we have the comet color or the purple if you like to call it that and we have a black and then we have a dark gray first of all i think the design is really really cute that it has this kind of wrap or look like that is wrap i don't know if you can see it otherwise i will just show you like this the bar comes with removable pads the second reason why this is one of my favorite bars is that it kind of like gives you a cleavage and there, there are two sport bra launching this saturday but i definitely prefer this one it is it as it is the most supportive one of them like it's pretty and it just do the boobs good i mean this is one of the only sport bra that i get a cleavage in so what's not to like i really don't have much volume on my breast so i like that and it makes me feel feminine so for my chest i could probably fit a size extra small cup wise but i do need a size small around the chest here because i'm quite wide and have a wide back 
and I'm also gonna put my measurements down below so you can totally compare yourself to me and get a better view of what size you need to order. Now the back of this sports bra has this little, I don't even know what you call this, I totally forgot, but this is how it looks and this is a elastic band so no adjustable straps but it kind of will adjust itself but there are all the colors you need to match all the og revivals that just launched last time okay the next item is our okay so the next item is our surface tri bra this is launching in four colors black the white sunny blue and the dreamsicle i absolutely love 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 that this bra is showing so much of your back I think that's super sick. We want to show them sexy back muscles because yes, it is sexy, not masculine. I am wearing a size small again. This one is a bit more loose and a bit less supportive than the wrap bra. And again, this comes with removable pads. And actually, like for both of the bras, the wrap bra and the tri bra, I recommend you stay true to size. Like I am always a size small in all bras always so yeah stay true to size because i'm a small in both of them and they fit perfectly and i definitely recommend that you get maybe one of each style because they're really both worth it they're both some of my favorite items i totally forgot to say it but the alpha lead logo here is i don't know if you can see but it's it's not printed on it's like rubber that you can feel it popping out So yeah, like this, you can kind of see that it's popping out. So don't be afraid, like when you wash it, it's not gonna start peeling or anything. And it's the same with the wrap bra. And I totally forgot that they're actually coming out with one more style of bra, uh, which is the surface keyhole bra in like khaki green. It's only that one color, which I'm also wearing a size small in. That one is definitely the most supportive of the three of them because it's covering almost your entire chest just with a li little hole here so it's definitely good if you're doing cardio or things where you're jumping and stuff like that and there's also one more thing it is the surface crop tank hoodie in the dark gray color that matches the joggers that i'm wearing now i also don't have that one but these are two items that are already on the website just in new colors so now to some of the new items launching there are two new leggings launching and the first one is the surface pocket laser cut legging in dark gray and the khaki gray i think it's khaki gray it's called please don't be mad at me but it is a dark gray and a green i don't have the green so i can't show you i think i'll put up a picture here of both of the colors so the first one the surface pocket legging like the name say it does have a pocket here Oopsie. and what i like about this legging compared to the previous surface is that it does have these cute details down the leg so this is like the side of your leg and it goes all the way to the back so around where your knee is and it continues all the way on the back here. I think that's just a super cute detail. I absolutely love this material. It is so soft, like butter soft. If you already have these, you know that these are not as stretchy as the Revivals, but they're definitely way more stretchy than the Halo. Last time I got the surface leggings, I was wearing a size small and I found that they fit me good. But during Corona lockdown, I did gain some weight. It was also planned on gaining weight. And I chose to size up to a size medium. And I really feel like that was a good choice. I don't like my leggings too tight. I don't like the feeling that I can't move. I don't have enough room to move or do certain exercises like a deep squat. So I would say if you are in doubt, size up. So I am in between sizes. I'm usually a small medium. I wear a size small in the revivals. I wear a size medium in the halo and now I wear a size medium in these. The back of the legging has like this kind of V cut and these are the why is it not focusing? This 
is the logo it's very subtle that's really what i like about El elfery that it's all very subtle it's super modern super fresh and yes i do find them squat proof i haven't had any issues with my surface legging not being squat proof now this next item is our surface path laser cut legging and i also got this one in the dark gray they are coming in two colors as well which is the dark green khaki green and then this dark gray as the surface pocket these also have these cute new kind of designs with the holes in it be a little careful when you pull that you don't rip the holes but as the other leggings they have these holes or pattern on the front of the leg instead of the back of the leg so on the back they are completely plain and then it goes down the side and the front of the leg the cut on the bum is like this and again it has the same subtle logo they do have this like v cut in the front which i think is super pretty i love this cut however i gotta be honest with you guys that i do have a little tiny issue with the camel toe in these surface path leggings what i do sometimes is that if I don't wear underwear, I'll just put a pad inside the leggings or if I wear underwear, I'll just like wear a pad like an old person would wear a pad in their underwear and that really helps me but come on, it's a camel toe but yeah, definitely keep that in mind so if you want to avoid the camel toe then you should definitely go for the surface pocket legging because I have no issue with camel toe in those but um, these can give you a little camel toe especially if you pull them up a lot which I do, that's also why I like to wear a size medium I'm wearing a size medium in these as well and I prefer that because I would rather have some extra material that I can kind of hike up my butt crack because I just like to show my booty and it just makes the booty look 10 times prettier if you can hike it up a little. So yeah, keep that in mind. And once again, these are squat proof. Okay guys, so what just happened is that my battery for my camera died and I went out in the meantime to have some pictures taken. That's why I'm wearing a different color sports right now. But I didn't get to finish what I wanted to say about the surface leggings. But what I love about the Alpha Lead leggings is that they just all make you look so snatched like i don't have the most tiniest waist but they really work wonders on my body they kind of all just lift your booty a bit and then really tuck in your waist and i love that i think that's also why alpha lead is my all-time favorite brand so they're definitely flattering so i also quick wanted to say that the pattern on both of the surface leggings now why can't you see it? Like here. It is whole, so you need to be a little careful when you pull. So you need to be a little careful when you put them on. Like, um, don't pull where the holes are. Really, really try to avoid that because like, it's just common sense that if you rip in a hole, then the hole get bigger and you'll ruin it. It hasn't happened to me. It's the same with my revivals. I've never had them broken, but be careful take care of your leggings so as the same as i said in my previous video when i showed on showed how to put on the revivals like start around <laughs> your angle and like roll them up or just kind of slowly pull them up and then yeah then you should be fine that's what i do with all my leggings anyway if you don't have any of the surface leggings already then they are super super stretchy and the same is here. but i really just like that they made these patterns because i feel like the old surface was so basic you know it wasn't like it was just a basic leggings but i just love the small details i just love all subtle details that's so me personally i'm not into crazy crazy colors or crazy crazy pattern but I really like small details and I think they really nailed in on this one, this design. So yeah, I highly recommend. 